Most of the people who are reforming me, <coughs> well, not most of them, but are the people who have issues and people who are targeting individuals. And uh, then I have another one to see. And then I have <coughs> two to see. Uh, I have two to see from the people who are working on the social media and then the reforming administration. <coughs> This is not my segment. My segments are very positive ones. And uh, the first two things about me. Uh, 10 to 20 percent of people are now voted for things to people and they give me a shot. So that means these are the positive measures. And if you are sensitive, that means that you should have a choice. Say men, since you are like the rock type, and 80 percent If you are, what you are. That means you're not a kind of metric, you're not a kind of stereotype, you're sensitive, and in your first phase is you ra your role from the beginning. So till yesterday you've been majority, which is true, but still thinking and feeling mostly as a majority. Now you suddenly realize that there is a big shift around you, and therefore you react to panic and fear. On top of that, you don't look. If you think that it's absolutely significant for the system when your aura starts to change and when you start to ask the truth, you're wrong. In that very, very first phase, you're gonna be, you're so gonna be contacted by the Illuminati. You're gonna learn from them meditation techniques, same as I did. My first one was transcendental TM, transcendental meditation in '97. That cost me 100 Deutschmark. Back then, that's now like 50 euros. And then still a method mind control back in 97, which is totally not a technique, but good, costed me $100. So they will sell you this meditation technique with the ideology. And this is actually a happy phase because you start to discover meditation and stuff, but still you don't know nothing, therefore you don't target it. But your meditation and your spirituality is controlled because every single religion and sub religion under the umbrella of New Age is theirs. It's always useful. So, you persist, you start investigating 911, game trails, and stuff like that because your consciousness is starting to integrate and then you start feeling true. And then you end up in a conflict with the rest of society. You simply cannot integrate consciousness because. It cannot integrate something which exists only in one little dot in the world. And that little dot gives him power to know how much money he has in his account, and how much is the rent, and how to keep his ass to get another paycheck. This is his consciousness. Therefore, he does not give a shit about 911 and about cancer. So you're hitting the first wall of normality. And that wall is telling you what? that you are not normal, and on top of that, you are targeted. Ah. Suddenly, you have two factors in your life, <coughs> and you don't know how to deal with it. Because even when you progress to this stage, when you know that you are targeted individual, <coughs> that you know some spiritual truth about demons, factors, and so on, there is nobody you can contact. Same as I have nobody actually to contact. What is that telling you? And that tells you, unfortunately, truth that you are alone. And that is a bummer because that is the critical thing because you are not alone. You simply did not manage to get to another point, which is the full separation of your consciousness, <coughs> which is also a process. So, once you start doing that, their attacks emotionally on you want to be next to insignificant. Because in that phase, first, they've been attacking you not only with the 
Maybe not even with that, but they've been attacking you in the first place mentally. Okay. Mentally means mentally, meaning you hang out together and then they scared who's the threat in the area. Sooner or later, it's going to be you. And then you're going to go through an emotional crisis. You're going to feel anxiety and pressure. Your thoughts are going to run and you most probably going to start thinking about your worst fear. These are all symptoms of psychic attack. Because they're going through your bio, through your memory, they know they're very powerful mentally, some of them. And do not forget, they always have access to the artificial intelligence, which is hardware into lots of data. They can coordinate it like that, and then have it. And at that point, if you don't know what is happening, it's critical because you can either commit suicide, and people do this because they can't handle harassment plus economical difficulties. And then you have another thing. Let's say that you are middle class, so you can actually afford to go to doctor. So you go to doctor, and then doctor goes <laughs> down. He will then make you send it to and then you are in the system because then you are in the mental institution next step and then you are marked as a good society. So again, what to do? First thing to do is do not buy the shit. Second thing is trust in self. Third thing is actually to do malanda meditation. To start integrating your consciousness and clearing your body from the parasite. Now, my personal question to you is, do you really want to be free? Because when we come to that, when we really come to explaining this, this is what must be done. You, what your aura is, your ego, what you think there is, when your consciousness is squeezed into this field and you think this is me, that you connect with your soul and then with the spirit or with the truth. And then you start to connect. And then you start to connect. And the next thing is, of course, feeling the parasite. And the next thing is always putting the guard and protecting and so on and so on. All these little difficulties from past caused by the mental attack want to be simply broke. Because now you're going to deal with another way of that, which is modern smart way of how to work. System then simply raises the deal and goes into next stage, which is full scale pilot. But then you, because you have no other option, you go into more integration stations, which results in the more collective, more sensitivity, but more stability. Therefore, you have to think more options. And this is your weapon. You see, everything what the system is doing, what they are doing, they are trying to disintegrate your consciousness. They try to make you into <coughs> normal person flesh. Two to ten sentences of science. Actually, it's a ten. Because this is the concentration. Two minutes. Ten. Stop. Okay. Real schizophrenic is somebody like a girl who is talking something disconnected. And these are what? 20% of alcoholics and those on film. Still, these people can manage to do something and like work themselves. And this is exactly this is one thing you must never buy from society. If society is telling you that you are good enough because they're not giving you a job, maybe they're not simply giving you a job because they don't want you to include other slaves on the job plan. Because jobs don't really exist for economic reasons, most of them now. They exist for the purpose of social control. Therefore, people is not giving you a reward, which means a job is, and then you feel unloved. And then others who have job is, are going to look at you down like, what's problem with you? I mean, doing the job is easy, of course it's easy. If you just a little work, if you go for a president, if you go to army, rape and kill what they want, then you have a president. 
if you don't, it's a bit more difficult. If you start waking up, you don't. So, if all of you, every single one of 100, let's say, targeted individuals on the YouTube or watching this, want for me personally to give you guidelines for your life, it's only me knowingly, um, not even a picture, maybe a picture of an actor and some nigger. Not gonna happen because I can't. I can't live your life and I can't live your life. All I can do is give advice and advice you for something people do not like to live. So, my advice is you have no other option but to connect to the truth and connect to others because that is actually where you are. What do you think? How much longer they can really play this game? It's all in numbers. As long as, as long as we are buying their reality and not communicating our reality and experience, they can play the game. And this is another another thing I have to say to YouTube and <coughs> all both sensitive people and targeting and everything, especially in modern. You don't hide yourself. When you're hiding yourself, you play your game. And I understand this game. You have some <coughs> some friends who are not targeted. He's a nice person. It's always nice to talk to somebody. And then moment you tell him weird stuff, woo woo. He's gone, right? So we all been playing games, but this is not how it works. Because if you're playing a game, if you're withholding the truth, then you're helping the lie. So my advice would be so specific. My advice would be put your face on YouTube, tell exactly what's happening. If you can upload pictures, upload all other data and then connect. And then connect with others. You will definitely <coughs> inspire others. You have to come to that point where you can actually say that you think on YouTube, of course. But once you get there, you get it. And that is it. And this is exactly what you're trying to kill with the programs of input. And 30 minutes, do I have another one or two to explain the most important program of input? Is, is exactly that what they're teaching you throughout your life. When they put you in a line in a church, when they put you in a line in a school, when they put you in a line in the army, <clears throat> when they tell you who you are and what you're supposed to think, this is all program of sympathy. And as long as you're playing with the program of sympathy, you have a place in the system. Once you start challenging it and finding your own power, then it's a problem. Okay? So, whatever is stopping you in your do not forget, it is the program of input. On top of that, <laughs> on top of that, just imagine that pretty much where every single individual on this planet has etheric implants, has astral implants, and in some cases, uh, real. Funny little pieces of metal with the outside, <coughs> alien. So, we all have them. Now, how much free you really are. And yet, the 2% two percent, two percent you are in this world. Imagine this as statistical mistake, because anything under 5% of the people, sorry, this is not this is something I learned as a program, yes, as a child. <coughs> yeah? So you are what you believe is statistical mistake, how big you actually are, over and out.